He is a star indeed. And keep in mind, no Canadian male has ever won a downhill at home. Now, they've had a couple of training runs, and Rob won the first training run. But keep in mind, as you said, Brian, under different conditions, his time actually in that run was 2.15. But Rob Boyd has got the motivation today to really go for it. Skied the weasel superbly. It was down into a very low time. Let's watch him through the fall away here. Arms back a bit. Skis up, but he just let it just come back down. He was into his tuck very early, and see, he much wider than all the tracks earlier on. He let it run oh, out. Wow. He didn't panic. And look how low he is in his tuck. Look at the way those hands are up in front of his face. He is really holding it low, much lower than Mark Girardelli did through this thing. Bit of a slide, and he's a bit wide coming through Coach's corner. But again, snapping down into that low tuck. We'll see at the interval time where he stands against Zubrigan. Excellent, excellent. Only 12 hundredths of a second behind, so it depends on how Rob Boyd handles these lower bumps. Very nice in the air, a good relaxed landing. And again, look at the way he uses that form, that aerodynamic form. When he gets the shot, look at how low he is. He's got the hands right up in front of him. He couldn't have a better tuck position. And very low on the final bump, good form. Remember, the time you'll see on the left of your screen belongs to the leader, Pierman Zerbrigan. Yes! Oh, yes! Unbelievable! Unbelievable! Rob Boyd with a sensational run! Brings them to their feet all over British Columbia. Just what a run he made up four tenths of a second on Zerbrigan. Please, Demo. Rob Boyd told us prior to the 